Good morning. Good morning. We welcome you to the house of worship once more again. How's everybody feeling? Everybody doing all right? That, that, that would be okay if you were applauding me. I said, is everybody doing all right? Because who we serve a God that saw fit to wake us up this morning and start us on our own.
emotionality of the moment. And all of that is good and fine. But sometimes we need to be reminded
confidently believing that God has heard your need and he will meet your need. Amen? Amen? And amen. Before we close and just
Reverend Benson's also our Sunday school teacher, which can be found on Facebook Live and later posted to our website and our YouTube page. Amen? Amen. If you all please stand to your feet. Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for your word, that reminder for us to go deeper. We thank you also that through song you said for us to, to give us you because everything else to wait. And we're living a trying time right now, God. And we've seen what happened over in Afghanistan. And we want to remember the military, we want to remember the families and the friends of those that lost their lives and that have been affected by the tragedy that is happening over there. But here's what we stand on. We stand on the fact that you already knew and that you have dispatched your ministry angels already to meet that present need. But we, as the body of believers, let us not be so sheltered that we forget to pray for those that are going through trying times. Pray for those that are being persecuted. Pray for those that don't have the freedoms that we have here in the United States. Keep our troops safe. Keep anyone that's being touched and affected by this situation safe. And more than that, Father, we pray that this might be an opportunity for some man, some woman, some child that may be living in that place to meet you. And that because they can see your salvation in the land of the living. That is our prayer. That more people might be drawn to you and that they may be brought into the ark of your protection and we'll be careful to give you all the praise. And now unto him who is able to keep us from falling and able to present us faultless before his presence to the only wise God, our Savior, be glory, majesty, dominion, and power, both henceforth now and forevermore. People of God said together, Amen. We look forward to seeing you again next week. Amen.